Tuesday morning. Darth Vader here is getting ready to go to school. Hey, hey. ready to go to school? What's my name? You tell me. Darth Vader. <laughs> Darth Vader. Um, yeah, Tuesday. I uh, don't really have any plans today. I'm just gonna clean. Um, and there's not a lot of cleaning to do. Um, I think I need to run to the post office for, uh, I'll talk more about that when I go, but, uh, okay. Okay. Yesterday's episode finished, uploaded, ready to go. You've already seen it by the time you've seen this one. I am, I still got to make the bed. I got him on the bus and sat down and started editing yesterday's footage. Um, I got to get that done, get a shower, get dressed, rush to the post office, you know what, maybe I'm just, I'm going to go to the post office, then come back, do all this stuff. <sighs> yeah, I think that's a smarter <laughs> idea. Because I don't want to take too long and then be at, stuck at the post office forever and be worrying about whether I'm back in time for the kids getting off the bus. So the reason I'm going to the post office is, well, I'm, I'm taking this. We've sold this on eBay. It's a 100 year anniversary bandana. Harley Davidson bandana. Like, I'm gonna say 2007. Yeah, it was 2007 when I was working for the Voodoo Lounge. Oops, I forgot. I probably had to put shoes on before I go outside. When I was working for the Voodoo Lounge at Harrah's, they had a um, like a charity ride, Harley Davidson ride, and they the uh, Harley dealership had left all these bandanas to give out to the to the riders, and none of the riders. To, I, I think I handed out four, but they dropped off like two cases of bandanas. <laughs> And then we said, what do you guys want us to do with these bandanas? And they said, ah, you know, just give them out to people. The event was over. Like, <laughs> so I said, eh, this might be worth something. So I went ahead and took a case home. I asked my boss. He said it was perfectly fine because we were probably going to throw them away. It wasn't something we were going to continue to give out you know, over the next few weeks at the bar, just so, so he said, yeah, you can have them. So I brought home this case. I want to say there were probably a hundred and some bandanas in there. So over the last, what, eight years or so, we have occasionally posted one or two on eBay to see, um, see if we could sell any. And so here's one that I, I'm just telling you these things have sold from anywhere between 20 and sixty dollars for one bandana but it's just it's just occasionally we remember to uh, post it so Casey had one posted I think I think it sold for like 35 bucks or something like that so yeah so I'm gonna go <laughs> mail it to the guy cool right Am I allowed to film at the post office? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. How are you today? Not too bad. That didn't take very long. Usually when I go to this post office, it's at least a half an hour wait. That was less than 10 minutes. <laughs> like I just, I guess I came at the right time. So here's a trick my mother-in-law taught me. Um, when you're putting a pillowcase on, go to the 
back of the pillowcase. I've got my arm inside of it. Go to the back, find the seam, but grab it by the middle, then turn it inside out with your hand. There's the corners, but it's inside out. But my hand is still in there. Then you grab the middle back of the pillow. And when you got a body pillow like this, it's especially useful. And then you just turn it right the top. And you just turn it right side out over the pillow. It's like one of my favorite housekeeping tricks that my mother-in-law taught me. You know, instead of, you know, grabbing the pillow or really trying to pull it up, it works great. Mm, I love body pillows. So we have like 28 of them still to go. Not bad when you think about 20 to 30 bucks a piece. Yeah. 100 years of great motorcycles. All right, Hudson's home. Dominic's home. Hudson Ann, are you ready to go upstairs? Hey, are you glad to be home? Are you glad to be home, Dominic? Yeah. Yeah, did you have fun at school today? What did you have for lunch today at school? A cheeseburger. A cheeseburger? All right. I have a feeling Hudson had one of her big chewy seizures on the bus home or something because she has been asleep since she got home, which was about 4 o'clock, and it is now 8.30. Hey, Daddy! She woke up for about... 15 minutes, but she has been completely sacked out this whole time. <sighs> She'll probably be up all night now. She had a huge poop at school today and it leaked all into her Boston brace. So I had to wash all of that by hand this evening. Anyway, with uh, that being said, I think I'm going to end the vlog right here. See you tomorrow.